National Nutrition Natural Health Reviews. Three minutes of the latest naturopathic info with Canada's leading nutrition experts. Watch, learn, and get healthy naturally. Hi there, I'm naturopathic Dr. Jonathan Beatty, a health expert here at nationalnutrition.ca. Today we're going to talk about a little bit of a different health topic, which is what we call transdermal delivery systems. And I know that seems like a very technical topic, but essentially it's things that you put on your skin that are going to help with your internal health. And with that, we often don't think of the fact that many of the things that we're applying topically are soaking into our systems. It's one of the ways that we can deliver medicines into our bodies and can be very, very effective in certain people, especially those with impairments in digestion, if they've lost their ability to swallow, or if you have a, an intervention or a medicine that needs a long-term delivery that it's basically the easiest way to do this. You know, it's not really practical to carry an IV around with you all the time that, you know, might have a slow drip of the medicine into your bloodstream. And it's not very practical to ask somebody, you know, I want you to take this pill, you know, very small dose every five minutes of your day. That's a difficult thing to do. So often what we use is what we call these transdermal delivery systems. Probably the most commonly known is of course the patch. Um, that nicotine patch for helping to quit smoking, what it does is it's delivering low doses of nicotine across your skin into your bloodstream, um, thus you know, constantly activating your nicotine receptors to try and prevent the feeling of cravings for more nicotine. That's probably most people's exposure or understanding of transdermal delivery systems. Now, there are other ways that they can be done. Um, they can be created as lotions. In fact, a lot of your fat soluble vitamins, things like vitamin D, you know, if you struggle to uh, swallow them, they can actually be applied to your skin and it can uh, be delivered transdermally that way. Um, other nutrients can be, uh, can be uh, transdermally delivered, things like iodine, um, which, you know, it'll leave a big yellow stain on your skin, but over time that stain will go away as your body absorbs and utilizes the iodine. So, those are just some ways to consider transdermal delivery uh, of, your, uh, pro of your supplements uh, or of your medical interventions. And with that, again, some things we can bind in certain creams which can increase their delivery. And so we see this a lot with topical pain products where they'll use analgesic drugs or herbs and they'll put them in special delivery systems that increase their ability to absorb through the skin. And this sometimes allow for very targeted use of certain herbs. So St. John's wart oil is something I use a lot for nerve pain in my patients, but it has a very strong systemic effect. So typically what I'll do is I'll actually use it transdermally. And as an oil, it's better able to absorb through the skin layer because your skin has a nice layer of fat on it. And so things that are typically what we call lipophilic or fat loving tend to be more easily absorbed through the skin, which is why you'll find most lotions and things like that tend to be greasy. What you're really trying to do is improve the oil layer of the skin when you're using lotions. And with that, again, anything that's dissolved in those fats is going to be absorbed into the skin topically. So that's what transdermal delivery systems are. There's a number of different forms of them, but essentially they're ways that you're gonna get a medication or a vitamin or a nutrient across the skin layer or across that dermal layer. So I hope this helps you understand this topic a little bit better. Any questions or comments you can post below. Subscribe to our channel where you can check out more of our health videos. And last but not least, always remember, knowledge is health.